Hey there guys, it's Mia here. I am so excited. I am so excited about this quick topic today. And the message very simply is, uh, you were meant to shine. Yep. You are 100% meant to shine. I want, I, want to, I want to speak to those of you who you're gifted, you're talented, you're smart, you're sharp, that's everyone. Um, you have an ability to create change in this world. And I want you to shine on. The sun just came out when I just said the right. sun, sun just came out. Shine on. Um, you are meant to shine, okay? And um, sometimes when you're very, very talented at what you do, when you are always the person that's able to create results or create impact in tremendous ways, hey, Angela, I meet women who judge themselves because they are giants in every way and they don't consciously recognize Robin that they are judging themselves but what happens is they start to mute who they are not to show up as extra that special sauce uh, that they have and I want to challenge those of you here if you've been following me you know it's what I'm into I only work with giants women who stand tall for themselves who understand that the only way to change uh, the lives of others is to change your life and is to own what I call your bigness, the gifts and talented uh, talents that are inside of you, Kim. Hey there, darling, good to see you. Um, that are inside of you. The world needs your impact. They need your gift. They need your light. They need you to show up for yourself and not apologize for shining. All right. And I want you to understand this, that if ever you're in, in an environment and it requires you to mute your story, right? To not tell the truth, which is to tell the truth about the the impact of your gifts you're in the wrong room, okay? Like l literally, you're in the wrong room. Whenever you're in a place where you feel uncomfortable because being all of who you are, there's capacity there, you need to get out of that space. If ever you're in relationships that require you to not be all of who you are, you've got to change and elevate who and the what. And I, I really want to be hardcore around this because I think that a lot of times when women are uh, exceptionally smart and talented and gifted, a lot of times women of color, um, you guys know what I'm talking about. Women of color, people think like, you, you can go here, but you can't go right there. I'm not saying this is your experience, but I know that a lot of women of color follow me and this has been your experience. A lot of women who f follow me, this has been your experience where just because you are a woman, you could you could access this level, but this other level, this is not for you. Okay, this is only for, you know what I mean, the club, or this is for the club. And I want you to understand that that's not real, that you are meant to shine. Your gifts and your talents don't belong to any single person. You do not have to go through anyone's pecking order, ranking order. No one has to, you know what I mean? Um, no one has to decide for you when it's time for you to be your biggest and your greatest. And I know, I know, like, I mean, these are the conversations that I love to talk about. Good morning, Tamika, because we don't talk about it enough. And the women that I work with, the rooms that they're in, these are the things that they're dealing with every single day. Sometimes they're in relationships with like good friends, right? That they're like, do we have to talk about what you, what you did again? When you are a giant in every way, you create impact frequently. And you know, and you're pumped about it, right? And you, you deserve to have an environment that wants to see your light. And that's what shining is about. And whenever you are walking in a room and you can't say all of who you are, or what you bring to the table, it just isn't the right place for you in the dream and the vision that you have in your life. The right places for you will hold a space and a spotlight for you. They will shine more light on who you are. They will, you know what I mean, cheer you on and you deserve that. It's something that I learned for myself years ago. And whenever I walk in a space or any time I'm a part of anything and I can't be all of who I am, I am going to immediately remove myself from that conversation, from the table and create my own table and space. It's, it's fact, okay? Because the reality is that you were born to shine. Think about it when you were a kid, right? Like when you walk the way you walk, talk the way you talk. You know, people didn't, when you were learning these things, people didn't say talk like 
your brother, right? Like literally, it was like, listen to you, right? Like it was the way you did what you did. It was the way you learned what you learned. It was the way that you, you did your special sauce. And yet, as we get older, um, we often unlearn so much of what we, when we first got started, people celebrated us for being different, for being unique, for doing it our own ways. And then as we start to associate with people who have different skill sets, who didn't work as hard as you, who didn't study as hard as you, who weren't committed to the process, who didn't create the results that you've created, you know, then folks want you to show up just like them. But you can't because you're a giant in every single way. And I just want to honor you. And I want to tell you, you were born to shine. And if you ever want to live your highest and your best life, then you've got to show up for yourself and own the, the truth about who you really and truly are and put yourself in environments with people who also shine. Okay, like li literally, like it's really the reason that I do what I do is the reason that I create the environments um, that I do for my clients called giants. And I only want to work with a giant. I only want to work with women that have the ability and the capacity to see greatness in others who are willing to make deposits in the women in their life so that they can be better. Um, women who understand that they were put here, created to create impact. People who understand that there's more than enough room for you to be authentic in all of who you are without compromise. Understanding that you don't have to be a creative duplicator. In fact, that's the lowest vibration ever. Be all of who you are. And I hope that there's something that I'm saying to you from my heart because it's from my heart, like literally. And it's how I live my life. It's how I built my business. It's who I coach, right? It's what I want in my life more of in this year. I have an appetite to work with giants in every single way. And you were meant to shine. You were not meant to dim your light, right? And pretend, you know, put your, you know, tell part of your story, mute who you are. No, there's, there's nothing desirable about that, all right? So put yourself in environments that allow you to be the highest and truest version of yourself. And for those of you who have stepped into your dreams this coming year, I honor you. For those of you who haven't, shine on, like literally, right? Like your life can be unrecognizable one year from now if you just choose to show up for who you really are. You ever want to have the best motivation ever? Be yourself. Be your highest and tallest self, right? Own that girl, like be her. Have the courage and bravery to you pick up your jacks and go play where you can be brilliant and amazing and create impact with what your gifts are. I can tell you, I can tell you, like I could go on and on about it, but I hope there's something I've said today that encourages your heart um, because this is how I live my life and it's what I do. And, um, you know, as always, if I can support you in some way, you know, go to meandredrick.com, watch my webinar. It's 100% free if you want to learn how to package your knowledge into a high ticket product uh, on or offline. If you've been watching me and you've seen the hundreds of women who have created amazing results, not hype results, amazing results that you can just listen to them and you're ready for that next step, sign up for the giant experience. I'd love to support you going into the new year clear and with momentum. And if you're looking for a mastermind in January, join us for Elevate. You have to apply. And there's some details somewhere here on, on the page that you're on. You have to apply. But it's an incredible mastermind experience in Puerto Rico. Um, and we're already 30% full. I just announced it like a week and a half ago. Okay. We haven't even done half the interviews. Not even. Okay. So we know we're going to sell out over the next six weeks. So if, if you're looking for a mastermind experience, check it out. Right. Like, but, but show up for yourself. Put yourself in an environment so you can grow who you are and be all of yourself, okay? And any environment or any person that doesn't allow you or doesn't want you to, to tell the truth about who you are, you need to divorce them right now. All right, I love you. Have a great.